me. Oh, here we are. Look at that. I didn't even know I was on there. Good morning. <laughs> it is October 17th. It's a B day. It is always another great day to be a lion at Howard High School. We're filling our days with pride because we are Howard Strong. We got a quote of the day today. It's Monday, so we get a quote of the day. It's a great quote. The artist who aims at perfection in everything achieves it in nothing. Those words of wisdom from Eugene Delacroix. So it's also on Monday here. We have a great Monday. This afternoon, the uh, cheerleaders have a hosting competition here. So if you're looking for something to do this evening, come out and support our cheerleaders right here at the Howard High School Gymnasium. So I hope everyone has a marvelous Monday. Good morning, Lions, and I'm Moody. Connie, did you have a good weekend? I did. I'm just a little tired this Monday morning. So, Lions, let's please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, America and, to and to the republic, republic for which it stands, stands one nation under God, God indivisible, indivisible, with liberty and, and justice for all. The Pink Ribbon Club meeting will be tomorrow, October 18th, in room A107. All new members are welcome. We will be discussing fundraisers to spread awareness and support breast cancer research. Make-A-Wish Club will meet on Wednesday at 2.15 in room B206. See you there. Are you a fan of anime, Doctor Who, Harry Potter, Percy Jackson, Pokemon Go, Star Wars, or any other fandom? Do you want to hang out with people who love fandoms as much as you do? Come to the next general meeting of Fandomonium Society on October 28th from 2.15 to 3.00. In, the, in room N211. We will make plans for our costume party on November 4th. All students applying to the National Honor Society must turn in their applications to room A217 by Friday, October 21st at 2 10 p.m. There will be a meeting for all girls interested in trying out for girls varsity and JV basketball after school on Thursday, October 20th at 2 20 in room F124. The Jewish Student Union will be holding their first meeting on Monday, October 24th at 2.30 in room N107. All interested people are invited to attend. Attention UNICEF club members. Forms for t-shirts and dues need to be submitted by the club meeting date, which is today, from 2.15 to 2.30 at Student Services. If you did not receive an email with this message, please write your name on the UNICEF sign-up sheet on Ms. Greaves' door at Student Services. Additional t-shirt forms can be found there. Any students that are eligible and interested in applying to become a member of the Math National Honor Society should stop by room A213 or V137 for requirements and an application packet. Applications are due by November 1st. If social studies is your thing, one of Howard's newest honor societies, Rho Kappa, is having an interest meeting tomorrow at 215 in room N107. If you have any questions beforehand, see Mr. Hollander or Ms. Goldsmith. Attention all athletes. On October 19th, we will be having our interest meeting for, up, uh, for the in upcoming indoor track and field season. The meeting will be held in, ca in the cafeteria and will be starting at 2.30. Important information like the schedule, tryout standards, and team expectations will be talked about. If you have any questions, please contact Coach Weed. Hola, Che. There is still time to join the adventure in Argentina for spring break. The first student meeting is October 21st at 3 p.m. in R121. Please see Professora for more information. Attention all seniors planning to apply to the University of Virginia. Are you interested in being nominated for the Jefferson Scholarship? Successful candidates must, be demonstra dem must demonstrate up uncommon academic abilities, exceptional, exceptional leadership talents, and an understanding of the broader community around them. If you would like to learn more about this opportunity, go to www.jeffersonscholars.org. That is www.jeffersonscholars.org. Howard High School can only nominate one student. Students who are interested in this nomination should let Mr. Glenn know by October 28th, 2016. Attention all juniors and seniors. Several colleges, universities, and military branches have scheduled information sessions with Howard High. Please check Naviance for the list of scheduled visits. You must sign up through Naviance to receive a pass for the visit. 
Naviance will email you 24 hours in advance and this will be your pass. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Flanagan and Student Services. There will be a representative from Neff Company here during lunches on Wednesday, October 18th for sizing and taking orders for varsity jackets. Order forms can be found on the front page of the Howard High School website. This year, they will also be selling display frames to hold varsity letters. These are a great way for students to display varsity letters if they do not wish to purchase a letter jacket. These order forms can also be found on the Howard High School website. Make it orange and make it end. What are your true colors when it comes to bullying? If you care about safe and supportive schools and communities, make your color orange. That's great. Join LML for a tie-dye orange out party, Wednesday, October 19th, 2, uh, 2.15 p.m. in the senior courtyard. Bring your own t-shirt. Wear your orange shirt to school and the football game this Friday. Orange out! That's all, That's we, all have we have for you today, Lions. We, we hope you have, have a magical, magical Monday. Monday. Thanks, Moody, for filling in for Allie today. No problem.